Brad, you just stepped out of class. Tell us what you were studying today. Yeah, today we're an intro to preaching, so I got to hear some of the sermons from the fellows behind me, actually. So it was a good day, good day. What are you up to next? I'm going to the Canadian Finals Rodeo in a few hours here. You have tickets to watch? Uh, no, I don't. I am competing, actually, for the 14th year. What's your event? Uh, team roping. Not bull riding or anything crazy like that. But. So what is team roping? Um, team roping is there's a header and a healer, so there's... Uh, both on horses the header ropes a 500 pound steer around the horns and the healer ropes him around the feet and i would be the healer so you have to lasso both feet at once both feet at once or else there's a five second penalty so So how's the week gone so far going pretty good last night we were 5.4 we went third so we're sitting uh currently in about third place so doing all right and how much competition is ahead of you Uh, there's five days left so yeah hopefully we can keep plugging away did you grow up doing this? Yeah, I grew up on a grain farm actually by Daysland and basically grew up on a horse. Uh, since I was five years old, I've been team roping. So, Anyone ever ask if your mama told you not to grow up? <laughs> uh, yes. Um, <laughs> Mom bugs us all the time. We, we, some of us, uh, two of the three, uh, myself and one brother, still rodeo. And uh, she sometimes she says i didn't raise any rodeo bums i said well mom you kind of did like between you and dad we lived on horses so this is kind of what you get <laughs> well all of us here at taylor wish you all the best this week hope it goes well thanks a lot appreciate it thanks